tumesikia kwamba kuna cartels wamekuwa kikutana. Cartels ya former governor moja ambaye amekuwa ni governor wa Nakuru. Kuna cartel pia ya former contractors ambao wanakutana kwamba wamekusanya sasa tunasikia kufikia sasa 25 million. Wamesanya 25 million ya kufrustrate governor Susan Keheka azifanye kazi yake. Tunataka kuambia wale ambao wanahusika kwa juu ya kwamba sisi hatutaki eh, kushikwa mateka na hatutaki governor wetu kushikwa mateka na interest ya watu wachache. Hii count eh, ni kubwa kuliko mtu yoyote. Hawa cartels tunawaonya. Tarehe 25 hii ni wiki moja kufikia sasa. Ikiwa kwamba hamtakuwa umetoa hizi kesi kotini na ikiwa kwamba Chief Justice Martha Kome hata kuwa ameingilia jambo hili. We are going to call the mother of all demonstrations. Uh, this is Nakuru Business Community and we are here uh, representing all business community in Nakuru County. And uh, we want to say uh, what is happening in our account. We are not happy as a business community. And uh, we want to say uh, our governor, Madam, Madam Susan uh, Buru, has to be given time to, to do his work. And uh, when you go to court, uh, because of uh, either your own reasons, we want to tell you that you are making many people to suffer. Nakuru count as more than two, uh, two million people. And uh, those two million people are depending uh, in service delivery through the governor. Now, the way things are now, since we come from election, things have now stand still. And we want to say to these few people who are making our count not to move forward, uh, don't hold our governor hostage and they don't hold Nakuru business people mm. hostage. Mm. We are tired because of that. And we want our account to move forward. And uh, we as business community, we are saying this. All these cases, those who are people who are concerned, we want to tell you, uh, you are wasting our, 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 our time in business. And uh, we have lost a lot of business since uh, uh, time of election. And uh, when you see Nakuru town, business are stand still. 80% of business are lost. Na tunataka kuambia wale ambao wanahusika kwa juu ya kwamba sisi hatutaki eh, kushikwa mateka. Na hatutaki governor wetu kushikwa mateka na interest ya watu wachache. Hii count eh, ni kubwa kuliko mtu yoyote. Na hii count inatengemea eh, ufanye kazi wa, eh, wa, wa, wa governor pamoja na wale ambao ame nominate and we want to support our governor sasa sasa eh, through nomination eh, CEOs na CEOs we support her fully mm -hmm. na kama wale ambao wamekimbia kotini wanaona i5 we want to tell you keep off mm -hmm. because we don't want to be to waste more time eh, with you Tunajua kuko na mikora pale na wengine wanataka kupewa pesa. Tunajua kuko na makatels. Already wameanza kuuliza pesa. Wengine wanauliza 10 million, wengine wanauliza 20 million. Want to tell our governor eh, not to bow down because of these brokers in, in court. Tunataka kuambia kwamba eh, sisi tunajua tulimchakua governor tukampatia mandate ya kuongeza hii town. Na tumepotesa wakati mwingi wakati wa campaign na tangu hizi eh, 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 governor ingia kwa ofisi miezi tatu imeisha hakuna jambo lolote imeendelea tunataka kusema hivi eh, sisi kama business community hatutakubali kuendelea kupotesa wakati na ikiendelea hivi tutafanya maandamano kubwa in this count ya kusema eh, eh, mwisho wa kusumbuliwa umefika hatutasumbuliwa tena we are ready to do a very big demonstration yes to say hatutaki uh, kateos kuteka mateka county yetu kuteka governor wetu uh, mateka hatutaki kwa hivyo uh, tumeamua na tumesema ya kwamba enough is enough na tunawauliza all these uh, people in court to draw all these cases for the sake 
of Nakuru County. Na wajue ya kwamba wakati wa kupelekana kotini hiyo umepitwa na wakati. Kwa hivyo tunataka governor apewe nafasi ili aweze ku deliver service delivery to the people because people wa Nakuru are waiting the, the services from us. All the businesses in town are stand still. Na biashara sote sa town sote na sijua sote zile ziko mchini hata ukiangalia pale nothing is 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 going on na we we are waiting for governor to get into office so that all the business can start going eh uh, maandamano ni haki yetu na wakati wafanyabiashara wanafinyika wanafinyika au ndio wanajua mahali kiatu inauma na hakuna watu wanaenda kwa maandamano bila sababu na ikifika hapo ni kumaanisha kwamba watu wa biashara wamefika mwisho na ile kitu imefaki ni kuweza kwenda kwa, kwa maandamano ili waweze kupata haki yao mambo ya malicense hakuna mtu amekataa kulipa license but mtu anashindwa kulipa license au sasa biashara hakuna na biashara iko chini eh, for the last eh, miaka tano ambao tulikuwa kwa siasa hakuna biashara imekuwa ikiendelea kwa mji wetu wa Nakuru na wakati tulimchakua gavana wetu eh, Susan Buru tulijua kwamba atarudisha biashara zetu na ameamua kurudisha biashara zetu shida iliyoko ni vile tumesema hapa kumekuwa na mikora imeshuka imeenda pale kotini imeanza kusema ya kwamba eh, mambo ya masisi mambo ya masio eh, imeanza kupinga hiyo na tunataka tum, vile tumesema tutaki mambo ya makesi pale kotini ya ku Eh, rudi kutusuilia kufanya biashara tunataka kesi zote siondoke na kama sitaweza kuondolewa basi sisi tutaingia kwa maandamano tutaingia kwa barabara tuweze kuuliza haki yetu na tuna support governor wetu because sasa eh, tulimchakua tukimpenda na kama imefika hapo ya kusuiliwa kumshika mateka sisi kama wafanya biashara tumekataa na tumesema tutasimama nyuma yake na kuweza kusema ya kwamba lazima hizo keti kesi zote siweze kuondolewa pale mahakamani ama business stakeholder ndani ya Nakuru tumezaliwa hapa tumekulia hapa na I'm from a minority ambao lakini tunasimama sorry majina naitwa Shaib Zubedi I'm from a minority na tunasimama nyuma ya governor wetu ha excellency Susan Kihika sababu kuu ambayo sisi tumekuja hapa leo ni kwa sababu biashara zimechomeka kabisa ndani ya town na tunalozungumzia ni kwa sababu gavana wetu amefungwa kufungwa kwake ni kwamba hana foot soldiers ambao wako so that they can bring service delivery kwa watu na kama sisi ambao ni wanabiashara tumejitokeza kuzungumzia hili swala ni kwa sababu sahi ukiangalia na kuru nyuma ilikuwa biashara zinaenda masai 24 kulikuwa biashara zingine zinapita mtu hafungi naingia shift hii anaingia shift mwingine lakini saa hii ukipita tauni saa mbili mtu amefunga biashara kwa sababu hakuna kitu kinachoingia na nini. Na hatuwezi kusema makosa ni ya gavana wetu. Kwa sababu kuna kesi every Kenyan has the right to go and seek legality of anything. Lakini kama kuna grounds, kama kuna merit. Huwezi kwenda tu na kwenda kupeleka kesi on matters ambayo the nomination and the proceedings of the nominations of uh, CECs and COs followed legality and framework ya wao. Interviews zilifanyika na kila kitu na wakatolewa wakafikishwa so kutuapishwa kwao sisi kama task force hapa hatuelewi kwa nini na tungeomba wawekwe waapishwe kazi iendelee manake county sa hizi nakuru has become a city na haina hata miezi haijafika hata mwaka na it's supposed to become an economic hub gavana atafanya vipi kazi kama amefungwa mikono sasa sasa tunaomba kwa upande wa gavana yeye ako na executive orders kwa upande wake if she can she can execute them tupate kuendelea sisi na kazi na sisi tuko nyuma yake mia kwa mia na kama anavyosema chairman wetu hapa ifikie hapo kama hatu, hatutoweza kupata hiyo solution tutakuwa nayo kwa maandamano tutakuwa nayo kwa maandamano ili tupate lile ambalo tunalitaka na tupate pia governor wetu aingie ofisi nyororo zitoke apate kupata kazi yake na atufanye service delivery to all those 2. something million na Koreans. Thank you. Kwa majina naitwa Simon Sangale Olenasieku, mratibu wa Nakuru Business Coalition. Hakika ninajiunga pamoja na viongozi wa mabiashara mahali hapa 
kama vile ambavyo mnavyoona tuko na chairman wa, na, na Central Rift ambaye pia anasimamia business community ya Nakuru County tuko na viongozi katika soko tofauti tofauti katika mji wa Nakuri kutoka sub county moja na sako zambazo zimewakilishwa hapa zaidi ya sako 130 na wale ambao wanafanya katikati ya mji pia wale ambao wanafanya kazi ya chemist wale wanafanya kule sokoni wale ambao ni chairman mpaka ya mobile hawkers yuko mahali hapa mimi pia ningependa kutoa sauti yangu kama mratibu wa Nakuru Business Coalition ningependa kusema hivi hili jambo ambalo linaendelea katika koti za Nakuru pia ningependa Chief Justice Mother Kome aweze kumulika kaunti ya Nakuru kwa sababu tunaona kwamba ni kana kwamba kuna cartels tumesikia kwamba kuna cartels wamekuwa kikutana cartels ya former governor moja ambaye amekuwa ni governor wa Nakuru kuna cartel pia ya former contractors ambao wanakutana kwamba wamekusanya sasa tunasikia kufikia sasa 25 million wamesanya 25 million ya kufrustrate governor Susan Keheka azifanye kazi yake Tunajua wale watu wamepelekwa kotini, wameenda kotini kama petitioners. Ni watu ambao hawajaenda kwa kivyao. Angalia ile pata niko. Unakuta leo mtu amepeleka kesi ya CEC, baada ya siku mbili mwingine anakuja na jiunga kwa ile kesi. Baada baadaye tunaona kesi ya chief officer, bikika kidogo kuna mwingine pia anaongezwa mahali pale. Mimi ningependa chief justice Martha Kome. Aweze kusikia kilio cha watu wanakuru. na pia tungependa kiongozi wetu wa taifa mpendwa Dr. William Samuel Ruto uweze kumulika kaunti ya Nakuru. Hii cartels ambazo mulisema mutapambana na cartels. Hii ni cartels ambazo zinataka kudumisha kuweza kurudisha maendeleo nyuma. Sasa hivi hatuna governor um, governor yuko lakini hana CCs wale ambao wamechagua anaweza pitisha miradi. Tunaona kwamba masoko kama sisi wachuuzi. Tunataka soko ziweze kukamilika ili watu waingie katika soko. Tunaona kwamba mambo ya licenses. Kulikuwa na mambo ya kuweza kuleta a single license ili tuweze kufanya biashara pasipo kusumbuliwa. Na sasa tunaona kuna multiple licenses. Hii itafanyika aje? Ni governor achague cabinet yake, achague CEO CEOs wake. Mimi ningependa kusema hivi. Hawa cartels tunawaonya. Tarehe 25 hii ni wiki moja kufikia sasa. Ikiwa kwamba hamtakuwa umetoa hizi kesi kotini. Na ikiwa kwamba Chief Justice Martha Kome hatakuwa ameingilia jambo hili. We are going to call the mother of all demonstrations. Watu kutoka Naivasha, Gilgil, Nakuru Town East, Nakuru Town West, Bahati, Rongai, Subukia, Kuresoi North, Kuresoi South, Molo na Njoro, katika sub county zote 11 ward 55. Tutasanyika sote katika mji wa Nakuru. Tutafanya maandamano yale ambayo hakuna kitu kitaendelea hadi tuone haki imetendeka katika kaunti ya Nakuru. Hatutakubali Susan Keheka Mboro asiendelee kusumbuliwa imefika mahali ambapo amefungwa mikono. Imekuwa tu ni kazi ya court order after court order after court order former governor na hawa contractors ambao tunajua muna fund hii mambo ya kuweza kusumbua Susan Keheka tuliwashinda na tuliwakuja mara mbili kama chapati kwa uchaguzi wa tarehe na tisa mwezi wa nane. tafadhali jiondoeni katika siasa na kuru wewe governor tulikupatia five years uliongoza na watu wakakukataa sasa hivi tuachie madam Susan Keheka Mboro nafasi aweze kuongoza kaunti ya Nakuru kwa kipindi chake cha miaka tano. Tunaona kwamba tumemaliza first quarter ya financial year, July, August, September hatuna pesa. Tumeenda katika October, November, December the second quarter hakuna pesa. Hii kesi kiendelea mpaka the th mwezi wa tatu. Inamaanisha three quarters ya zile ambavyo pesa zikiatakana zikuja na kuru zitarudishwa kule mjini Nairobi. This is very sad. On 25th of this month we are going to do a demonstration ili tuweze kuhakikisha kwamba governor Susan Keheka amefunguliwa kutokana na minyororo ya hizi cartels ambazo wamemfunga mikono yake. Uh, majina yangu naitwa Anne Jehia na mimi nafanya biashara katika Nakuru County. Eh tushukuru Mungu kwa sababu ya asubuhi ya leo. Lakini siku ya leo tumekuja mahali hapa kuweza kuongea na ambao wanaweza kutuzuia kufanya kazi katika Nakuru kwa sababu kumekuwa na kesi nyingi ambazo zimekereko kotini kuzuia madam na kufanya kazi yake na sisi kama wafanya biashara tuna support 100% masio na CS ambao wamechaguliwa katika nakuru letu ili waweze kushikana na madam governor kufanya kazi ni kweli tulitoka katika siasa na wakati huu ni wakati wa kufanya kazi tuna support madam governor na, na watu ambao ameteua wafanye kazi na yeye na kama wameshikwa mikono kazi ya nakuru imesimama sisi kama wafanya biashara kazi zetu simesimama lakini tuko hapa siku ya leo kusema ya kwamba hao makatel ambao wamepeleka kezi kotini waweze kuitoa kotini ili tuweze kuendelea na biashara zetu na kama wafanyi biashara tumechoka 
na kesi kotini kila asubuhi na jioni kutangaziwa kuna kesi imeperekwa kotini na tunatangaza ya kwamba kama watatoa hiyo kesi tutaweza uh, kufanya maadamano ambao itakuwa kubwa katika Nakuru County tutaita watu wetu wote wafanya biashara ambao wamechokwa na hizi vituko za kesi kotini waweze eh, kufanya maadamano kubwa tukiweza kukemea hao cartels watuondolee kesi